Divish from salesforcearticle.com. Today I will demonstrate how to create your custom calendar in lightning experience. So first of all, what is custom calendar? So do you or your user wants easy tracking system, close date follow up on time, meeting confirmation, all above requirement you can create your own custom calendar and set up a date criteria as per your requirement. So date may be like close date, next action date, meeting date. So all this date you can put as a your custom calendar criteria. So here is this a three scenario and a demo as well. So first scenario is like sales users can follow up weekly, daily as per close date. Scenario number two, service users can follow up with the case closer date. Scenario number three is sales user can set up a meeting as per meeting date. Okay, so let's go for demo. So demo is like follow up is our new calendar and the criteria is your opportunity close date. So here is my Salesforce. I already logged in. So first you have to click on app launcher. Then after you have to search calendar. So when you search you can uh, find one item okay click on the calendar so default is a view is like a week so from here you can change to month so you can see all a month view you can see together over here on the top uh, uh, bottom side right side you can see a gear icon and you can click on a new calendar so when you click so the one pop-up window will open so first you have to select your or any Salesforce standard or custom object so we can select opportunity and say next here is some few uh, calendar details so we can say like follow up is our calendar name you can write anything as per your requirement here is the field is must so we can select close date okay so end is not mandatory so generally it will work like uh, when there is a start date end date so you can click select the start date over here you can select end date so in our case we don't require and here you can apply for the filter which you already created so we can select our opportunity marketing layout filter and this which field you want to show in your calendar so we can select a name of opportunity so we can identify which opportunity will close and then just press the save so your calendar is created so in like couple of seconds automatically the calendar will appear so you can see here okay so on the right hand side on a corner you can see follow up okay now you want to if you want to change the color so you just click on this drop down and then select any color it automatically change even you can select a custom color so click on this you can give the number or maybe you can give the pattern done and then this way and then just save it okay and you can see the past is, is a light color light color and like tomorrow I have to follow up this this is the opportunity name so when you click on opportunity name you, it opportunity will open so this close date if I select on a detail so I can see that close date is on 13th which is tomorrow so I have to follow up this opportunity because this opportunity is about to close tomorrow so this way you can click follow up calendar is currently be created you can create a different calendar as well okay as per your uh, requirement let's say meeting request or any calendar and if you want to delete you can just click here and delete as well if you want to edit if you can say edit and you can change your criteria and there is one more option called show only this calendar so other calendar will not appear and uh, thank you for watching my video if you have any query you can visit my website salesforcearticle.com you can even email info at salesforcearticle.com you can follow on my twitter jivisarjishna and Twitter as well for Salesforce article and Facebook as also. Thank you.